endometrial thickness it is a very important thing whenever we do an IVF cycle or we are planning for a pregnancy. So when we talk about endometrium, endometrium is the lining that is present in the uterine cavity and it is the place where the embryos are put and it grows there. So talking about endometrial thickness basically three things are seen, the lining, the measurement of it. So it is, it is supposed to be between 9 to 11 mm that is the optimal. But many patients who face problem of endometrial lining, in those patients if we achieve a lining of 7.58 mm also then also we do have a pregnancy. There are studies when patients have had pregnancy in less lining also. But definitely not less than 6 mm. If you are having a lining less than 6 mm then your infertility specialist needs to work on your lining. Second thing that comes is the endometrial blood supply that is seen by the endometrial Doppler. So the endometrium is divided into three zones. So the blood supply has to come to the innermost zone for you to have a healthy pregnancy. So for that also medications are given by the infertility specialist to increase that thing. Thirdly the thing comes is the endometrial volume, the space. Like you shift in a house, the space is also very important. So same thing applies true for the embryo also. The space is also very important for the embryo. So the endometrial volume that has to be more than 2 cc and that is very important. So endometrial Doppler study is a must before you are undertaking any fertility treatment or you are planning a pregnancy. So this is the take home message for all the patients.